After the expired Russian ultimatum, two 22M3 bombers were seen flying towards Mariupol. After the time had elapsed for the surrender of the Ukrainian military from Mariupol, long-range two 22M3 bombers were unexpectedly seen in the sky. Judging by the direction of the flight, the latter were moving just in the direction of Mariupol, probably to bomb the last Ukrainian troops and other formations. On the presented video frames, you can see how at least one long-range supersonic 2-22M3 bomber is moving in the direction of Mariupol. Considering that these aircraft often operate in pairs, there probably was a second combat aircraft, although the latter never made it to the video footage. Video footage was taken around noon, but there are no official statements about the use of long-range bombers at the moment. Earlier, Russia set aside six hours for the unconditional surrender of the Ukrainian military, militants, mercenaries and nationalists, promising to save the lives of those who lay down their arms and voluntarily leave their shelters in Mariupol, however, according to Avia.pro sources, the Ukrainian military refused such an offer. According to a number of data, about two to 3,000 foreign military, mercenaries and Ukrainian military personnel may still be on the territory of Mariupol. 